Hi there everybody and welcome to Mix It Up Into The Kitchen. That's right, Mix It Up Into The Kitchen and it is an open collaboration. That's right, and it's hosted by me, Brenda, Maniac Grammy. What you do is you can fix a meal of any sort, a drink, a dessert, a d'oeuvres, whatever, and post it on Saturday anytime. Or you can do anything you wanna talk about in the kitchen. You can talk about measuring spoons. You can talk about cookbooks. You can talk about anything you'd like. So that's what I have for you. I'd love for you to join in. I'd like to see this grow. And we have a recipe today. I'm sweating bullets in here. It's called Grandma's Iron Skillet Apple Pie. This is the first time I'm making it with you. Hopefully it comes out. It says a half a cup of butter, one cup of brown sugar, five Granny Smith apples. It is apple season here in Maine. They just started picking a couple of days ago. These apples were not picked here in, in Maine. You need three refrigerated pre-roll pie crusts. One cup of sugar divided, two teaspoons of ground cinnamon divided, a fourth of a cup of white sugar, one tablespoon of butter cut into small chunks, preheat the oven at 350, place a half a cup of butter into the heavy cast iron skillet. I'm gonna bring you now, down now because I have done that right here. The oven's on. It was preheated to 350. Put a half a cup of butter in, which I did, and it's melted. You want to remove the skillet and sprinkle brown sugar. Return to the oven to heat while you prepare apples. Well, I've already prepared the apples, so brown sugar. We have trivia right here. Brown sugar. Okay, and I got a flip-flop the way the recipe was. So brown sugar was one cup, one cup of brown sugar. You can do that. Hope everybody's doing well today. Hope I don't spill this. Sometimes if the brown sugar gets hard on you, what you can do is put a slice of bread in there and it will soften it up. Sorry about that. Wow. It's not that it's hard, it's just, it's just compacted. There. Just loosen it up a little bit. There she wants to come now. Okay. And for the brown sugar, it says, remove the skillet, sprinkle brown sugar, and remove, remove to the oven to heat while you prepare the apples. Okay, well, I've already done the apples, so we're going to sprinkle the brown sugar in. This uh, is pretty hot, so we're going to call that good right there. I'm just going to do this. Just like that. Wicked hot. I hope I don't stick your finger in there. You'll get burnt. Okay. Now it says, um, okay, remove the skillet, brown sugar, refrigerate pie crust on top of the brown sugar. I don't understand why so many pie crusts. I really don't, but I guess we're going to find out. It says you want to put one pie crust on top of the butter and brown sugar. Hmm. This should be interesting. Very interesting. Oop. I just seen a fly and I haven't seen a fly all day. Well, guess what? I just dumped some brown sugar on the floor. But that's okay. 
It's just brown sugar. I'm not editing it out. It's real life here. I'm gonna put it over here on my cutting board for a minute while I just get it rolled out. Well, not rolled out, but just taken out of the package. Okay. I still don't know how this is gonna go together. Okay, it says lay it right on. Okay, we're laying it on. Lay it on top of the butter and brown sugar. There you have it, right there. Okay, and then uh, remove the refrigerator pie crust. Top the pie crust with half sliced apples, sprinkle with half sugar and half cinnamon. Okay, half apples. You want your apples cut thin. I use this and then I cut them thin after. It just helps me out a whole lot. Put about half the apples in, just like that. Okay. Let's see. Brown sugar, remove skillet, pie crust on top. Top the pie crust with half slice apple sprinkle, half sugar, half cinnamon. Half sugar. Need a call for a cup of sugar. So, let me get a cup out here. I'm using Stevia, you can, you can use the real deal. It said half, okay? It is half, okay. Sprinkly apple sugar and one teaspoon of cinnamon. Oh, that's nutmeg, okay. Ground cinnamon, one teaspoon. Oh, I like lots of cinnamon. Mmm. Yum, 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 yum. Okay, and there's that. Top the pie crust with half sliced apples. Sprinkle the apples. Half a cup of sugar and a half a cup. Okay. Top the pie crust with, okay, we did this, app, sprinkle the apples with sugar and cinnamon. Place the second pie crust over the apples. Okay, second pie crust over the apples. I'm gonna be just as interested on how this is all gonna play together. I've, I have read this and read it and read it and read it and I just couldn't, couldn't get it through my, Thick skull. Okay. Let me just roll this out on my cutting board here. It's on my side. Okay. It says, top the pie crust, half slice apples. Okay. We're gonna put it in just like that. We're doing what it said. Oh, please come out. <gasps> okay. Top the pie crust with half slice apples. Sprinkle the apples. Okay, here we go. Oops, got some little sugar, I think, right there. Here goes the apples again. There we go. Just like that. Okay, fourth of a cup of sugar. This time I'm gonna use some brown sugar because I'm gonna use half and half because it didn't say brown or white. So I'm just gonna do this. Then I'm gonna do this. Okay, just like that. And 
We need cinnamon. Cinnamon, let me in. Okay, the tablespoon of cinnamon. Maggie's looking at the brown sugar that fell on the floor behind me. She's thinking, Mama, what'd you do? Okay, place the second layer crossed over. I did that of the apples. Okay, sprinkle the sugar and cinnamon. Top the third crust. Top the third crust with one fourth sugar with a dot. Okay, need a little bit more sugar, it said. Just like that. What's the matter? Did Mama scare you? Huh? Did Mama scare you? Okay. And it says, we got the third crust is on top with some sugar, dot with a tablespoon of butter. Okay. I don't usually like putting butter on top of mine, but that's what it says. That's what I'm going to do. Just gonna put it like this around. This is a little bit more than a tablespoon, but I'm gonna stop here in just a second, right there. Okay, now it says we got the sugar, we dotted that. We're gonna put the last layer on. Like this. I guess as you follow the steps, it'll come out okay. <laughs> I hope it does. They're going back and forth, back and forth. If I was to write this over, I think I'd write it a little different in steps, but I wrote it the way they had it. So it is what it is. Let's say as it is. Okay, then you're gonna put this over it. Okay, now I was gonna fold it under, but I guess we'll fold it the best we can so we don't want anything dripping out. Some will go under and some will go over. Now it doesn't say to do a whitewash, an egg wash for the top, so I'm not gonna do it. Normally I would do it, but it does not say to do it. So I'm not going to, simple as that. Now it says make some slits, okay. One, two, three. I'm just gonna do a cross and a cross and a cross. Whoa, get in there. Okay, everybody. Ooh, ha ha, it's going back in the oven. Four. 45 minutes. Okay, everybody, I am going to cut this apple pie. It's still a little warm. I'm not sure how it's going to cut, but we shall see. Hopefully it will come out good. Fingers crossed, toes crossed. Is that a yay or a nay? Oh, I think it's gonna come out great. I do, I do. Whoops, it did come out good. Wow, awesome. 
You don't want to cheat anybody some apple apple pie now. I'm just going to put this here. Cooked up good. Here it is right here. I don't know if I can pick it up. I can't pick it up. I got a spoon just in case it didn't come out. I like mine a little soupy. But that's okay. This looks awesome. What do y'all think? Anybody gonna give it a try here? I've got a spoon and we have a special guest to try it. Hi everybody, look who's here, it's Mr. R. He just came in from outdoors and I told him we had apple pie. So what do you say, Ray turned around so they can see it? Good around. Pie. Good. Look at that. Good pie. I know it is. You know it's good pie? I know it is. Okay. If you made it. I didn't eat it. If you made it. Oh, if I made it, it's good pie. Yes. Well, thank you. Of course it is. Okay, here we go, people. Maggie's looking at you. Maggie ain't going to get any of this. Oh, sure she is. This is too good for her. Maggie gets everything. Hmm. Apple pie. I like apple pie. That's good. But it's still warm. Do you think you'd like it with no, ice I, cream? I don't. I don't like ice cream in apple pie. I know you don't. I don't know why. I just don't. I just prefer. I don't like whipped cream or nothing. I just like pie. Now, how does it have a good flavor? Of course it does. Do you think it's cooked really well? Yeah, cooked just right. Okay, so would you want me to make this again? Please do. Do you, can you understand why they had three pie crust on that thing? Three. Yep. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Maybe to get your cops? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, everybody. Go ahead and rate me honestly, Ray. Give me zero if it's worth the zero. Give me ten if it's worth ten. If I want another one, I'd better say ten. No, no, it is. It's good. It is. Okay. Thank you, Remember. everybody. You never know what's going to be on my videos. So there you have it. Apple pie. Bye now. See you tomorrow.